Alrighty, well, hello everybody. How is it going? Once again, welcome back to another video. As you can probably see from today's title, we are going to be leveling up Gene. Um, I've been wanting to do this for a while because I've always thought Gene was a really good character, so let's see it. I think she still is too. But yeah, as you can already see, all my other characters are leveled, so we're going to go for Gene next. As you can see, she also has the Asuna skin on. If you do not know, it is from an anime. Uh, if you haven't seen the anime, check it out. The first season is pretty good. A lot of people hate the other seasons. I like the entire anime. I think it's good. So yeah. Anyways, we're going to start with the level and get her to level 20 so far. Then we're going to go ascend her. We only have enough to ascend her to level uh, 80. And nothing past. Like nothing to 90 or anything. So yeah. Um, so as you can see, we're already at 50. Or we're getting there at least. Now we're at 50. Yeah, there you go. Um, also, by the way, I just want to make sure. Um, if you enjoy the video, please make sure to drop a like. And if you find yourself coming back, why not subscribe as well? Alright, so as you can see, she's now at level 70. Um, one of the other things to keep in mind is she wasn't actually meant to deal a lot of damage. As you can see, she has healing bonus. Her Q is meant to heal the entire time. That's what her goal is. Um, so that's why she may not deal as much damage. She's on dull blade right now, but obviously we're going to switch it out for, you know, the best weapon for little spenders. So yeah, we're going to level this weapon up too, just so we can get the crit rate. Hopefully it wasn't a waste. I don't think it was, obviously, but, you know. I know a lot of people might say, like, oh, you could have gotten a weapon for Xiao. You could have gotten a better weapon for Ganyu, even though Ganyu's on her signature weapon. Literally. So, yeah. Um, as you can see, we're already at level 50 for the weapon, or ascended to 50. Now we're going to be level 50. Um, so, yeah, this is not bad. All right. Oh, yes, by the way, let me know in the comment section down below. Um, do you guys want to see me play more Withering Waves? This was made during the stream when I was playing it, so yeah, let me know if you all enjoy it. Alright, so as you can see now, right now we're getting it to level set 60, because we don't have enough. Oh, now we're getting, now we have enough to level 70 yet. Apparently we can't level 80 yet, I forgot to grab some materials. So yeah, it kind of sucks that I didn't do that, but you know, it's whatever. I'll make sure to grind it out later on. I'm obviously not going to put that part in a video or anything because it's just, you know, 10 levels. So, yeah, whatever. So, now it's at level 70 with 22.2, 22.7 crit rate. And now, we're, so you can see right now the crit rate is 22.7, 27.2 or 7. Bleh, I can't speak. <laughs> but, yeah. All right. We're going to get the talents leveled up. So, we're going to do everything up to one first. And then once we get more of those things, more of the masks, we'll do it higher. All right. So, as you can see, everything level 2. Now... We're going to do to level 6. We're going to level 6 everything, and then we're going to stop it right there. Um, because I haven't grind e grinded any of the dragon materials, which I need for her, obviously. Uh, Devalin, I think is what his name is. I forgot. Um, so I'll make sure to do that later on. But as you can see, level 4, level 4. Uh, we're going to level 5 or level 6, both of these. Both the talent and the skill first. And then if we have enough for the, um, or the skill and the burst. Sorry. Uh, and then if we have enough for the melee, we'll do that, because her melee is not the most damage. Seems like we have enough, luckily, which I was kind of worried about, because usually I don't, I try to farm for these, but this video was on just time limit. Also, you didn't see anything. You did not just see that. <laughs> yeah, don't say anything. You didn't, you didn't see nothing. It would never have happened. Anyways, <laughs> I'm just kidding. But yeah. Okay, so as you can see right now, we're getting to, we're already level six everything. Um, I'll probably grind out the materials later on, but right now, she seems like she's pretty good. Alright, now we're on to the final thing, which is going to be, uh, artifacts. By the way, she is a Constellation 2, so that could contribute to everything. So, uh, yeah, as you can see, we have a crit rate, crit damage piece. Let's see if it goes crit and crit damage. If, dude, I hope, aw, uh, I'm worried. Imagine this just goes defense and I get screwed over. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, uh, dude, that is horrifying. Uh, please don't. Please, crit rate, crit damage. Yo, okay, okay, we got 14.8 crit damage, let's go. Come on, now just crit rate. Come on. I think I said crit rate back something. I mean crit damage. Yeah, well, yeah. Crit rate, go into crit rate, please. Come on. Come on. Yes, let's go. All right. Now it just needs to go into crit damage one more time, and we're good to go. Listen, this is a perfect piece in my eyes. I'm not going to complain one bit about it. I could, but I'm not going to. Let's go. 50.5.8 over 21.0. So that's really good. Alright, so as you can see, we got it on the Viridescent, uh, however you say it name, its name. So, uh, we have other good flowers, or feathers, now we're going to do this one. 
We're going to try leveling each of them all up. Let's see if we can get lucky. Hopefully this one goes into crit rate. If it does, we're going to be pretty lucky. If it doesn't, well, oh well. And it doesn't. Come on, second piece. Come on, crit rate. Give me some luck. Yo, let's go. Double crit. 3.5 maxed out. Okay, crit again. Let's go. Nice. Yo, come on, crit damage. Just crit damage. Okay, you know what? I'll take crit rate again. That's fine. Yo, crit, crit damage. Let's go. Okay, defense. That's not good, but you know what? We'll take it. I could complain, but it's a good piece. 13 to 10. Bro. That's already like 30 to 40 CV. Alright, so we don't really have any of good Sans pieces, so let's not focus on that. We have a good um, circlet. Now we just gotta hope it rolls well. And of course, I have a bad feeling. Yep. Of course, it just goes defense. And again, I don't like this piece. I gotta switch this to a crit damage one, man. This is a horrifying piece. Alright, so we're gonna get rid of this piece. And, or I mean this one, sorry. Because this one rolled terribly. And this one did as well. Watch. Yep, call it. Defense again. Man, this artifact set just loves defense. Sadly, I don't have any other good pieces, so we'll keep it on that. Um, Just got to make sure to actually switch it back later. Because I forgot to, apparently. <laughs> Alright, so let's try uh, this piece. Let's see if we get lucky. Come on. Crit damage. Or er, crit rate. I can't tell if it's Curry Academy. Yeah, Curry. Come on. Let's throw a piece that we don't actually like. Yeah, we'll, we'll throw this one. And of course, it won defense. Dang it. I swear this artifact set is just defense loving. At least it won Curry Crit damage for the first two. I'll take it. Um, so, yeah, I guess let's just equip what we have. We'll do this one first, or this one second, actually, because we need to have it no matter what. Even though this one gives crit rate and crit damage, we need to have a four piece set so we can do swirls and stuff. Um, I think I forgot to change the circlet or put it on. There we go. Now I put it on. So for the sands, we're gonna go for the one we leveled, which is six point two crit damage. Not really good. Um, just to get the four piece, and then we'll just go for the animal damage. This one. So yeah, this should be pretty good. Hopefully uh, this works out. We got 74.2 over 102.1 with 16 per point six healing bonus and a 109.1 uh, energy recharge with 22.9, I think, uh, animal damage. So yeah, anyways, I hope to see you all. Alright, so we're finally at Abyss. Let's check it out. Thank you. Yes. That was really lucky stats, to be honest. We're going to check her out in floor 9. Uh, nah, we could do floor 12. We could give it a shot. <clears throat> so we're going to do her. You. Uh, her, Miko. Xiongling, and. He's on second just because. it's We're not using it, but yeah. So let's see how she does. Alright, so now that we're finally in the best, let's test her out. Alright, by the way, before we continue this, I just want to let you all know, if we get, um, let's say 20 likes on this video, then I will make some videos on Withering Waves, um, early on, obviously before I get the, what do you call it, get a high enough level, but we're seeing decent amounts of damage here too, also I am still going to be making Zero to Hero series videos, but if you want to see early videos, like, just playing the game before then, let me know, but yeah, this is not bad at all. The damage is a lot. A lot more than I was expecting, especially since she stuck at only a hundred crit damage. So yeah. We're taking these guys down oh like easily. No struggle at all. I'm actually kinda curious to see how what other teams would be really good. Other than obviously New Valette and all the other overpowered insta kill characters. But for characters like Hu Tao, Yalon, um, all that other stuff those count those are allowed so yeah I'll have to check it out later on but yeah I feel like my Xiangling or not my Xiangling but my Miko and uh, maybe my Jean are uh, soloing this <laughs> like my Xiangling is just there for extra damage or for fire but yeah anyways I hope you all enjoyed today's video if you did please make sure to drop a like and I hope to see you all again in the next one peace out everybody have a good rest of your day